Lex for Boldy. Two man game at it again. Boldy shot blocked. Kept alive by Addison. Upstairs now Zuccarello off to the left side. Kaprizov, he scores! He caught Andre off the post expecting pass. And Kirill Kaprizov has goals in six straight games. It was as if Zuccarello came up top and said, okay, enough of you young guys passing to one another. Let's introduce something else here on this power play. He gets it. One pass. Kaprizov waits. Finds a window on the short side. Ottinger lost it for a minute. He was not set for that shot. Back into the corner. Addison for Merrill. Starts taking away. Robertson and then scored on the rebound. Rope hits. Top line at it again and the Stars have tied it at one. Well, once they push the puck back down deep again, Flurry with that great play, one-handed around the boards, and Stars just say, we'll do it again. This time he doesn't get out there. It allows the Stars to get in on the four check, and they just basically mauled them. All three guys involved. Pavelski along the boards. Robertson feeds off of that. Outmaneuvers his man. Steele. The juicy rebound off a scrambling Marc-Andre Flurry. You load up too many against a one of the top power plays in the league and the law of eventuality starts to come in. It's a group that's feeling it right now for the Stars. They were two for four in the homestand opener on Thursday. Look out. Shorthanded Dewar is going to race after it. Wait, he scores! Dewar won the foot race to the puck. He gets the Wilds league leading fifth shorthanded goal this season. And the Wild are back in front. Well, once the puck got turned over along the boards and flipped back, Ryan Suter got into a foot race he could not win. And Dewar scampered in and outweighted Jake Ottinger, who sort of belly flopped on this one. And it was the patience of the fadeaway attempt and then elevation that got Jake beat. Tried to keep the right leg outstretched to make sure that he couldn't just tuck it. Middleton. On his stick as he re-enters. Horseshoes it to the far side. Jumped away from Greenway. He gets knocked down by Glenn Denning. Greenway had lost his stick in the process. Now it's Middleton. Fire score! It deflected! Middleton shot. Took a skip. Past Ottinger and the Wild extend their lead. Stars are in good stead, aggressive in their own zone. Delandria gets out in the shooting lane. It goes off him and eats up Jake Ottinger. Went right off of the back of his skate against the grain. It ends up being a sort of flip-flopper. Ottinger was really deep and not really on his angle on this and got beat over the glove. So a couple of guys who had not found the back of the net often score goals. Two and a half minutes apart from each other. Greenway looking for more. Chance stop. Rebound. Score. Greenway. The Wild have three unanswered. And they've opened up the afternoon's game in Dallas. Six and a half minutes to go in the middle frame. I'm curious whether you might get a goalie change or not. Not to blame that. Polino hands off for Erickson Eck. Put it in on Wedgwood. First puck that goes his way in relief. Steered to the corner. Greenway, who has the most recent tally. Spurgeon with a shot score. Erickson Eck, the deflection. 29 seconds into the third period. The Wild make it 5 1. And let it rattle in off of him. Slap shot, heading wide. Off the shin pad, back. Long stretch here without a whistle as Pavelski brings it down the left side. Flip, score! Rope hits! He's got his second of the game. Trying to inject some life here into Dallas. And this is borderline indecent. What a play. Pavelski first to back in. Now Lindell over to Hintz, flings it off the boards. Robertson finds Lindell. Stars work to get back onside, and they do. 
Hintz leaves it. Robertson, save made. He gets it back. He tucks it in. Jason Robertson. Two quick goals, and all of a sudden, it's a two-goal game. The Wild could never get him stopped up, and then Robertson just follows up his own shot. Reeves drops it low. Wedgwood out to play it, and almost got sandwiched. The puck along the end wall, and close to a turnover in a dangerous spot. Boxa ridden off by Middleton. Centering feed, score! Marchman! This is just a simple dump it deep, hustle after it, like a perfect triangle set up. Pavelski knew what he wanted to do with it when he got it. The business end is a lovely tuck by Marchman in front of the net. Here, Erickson Eck opening minute of the third is a huge hit in the corner. Middleton on Marchman, and Fox is going to drop the gloves. We've seen this several times this season. Fox and Middleton, helmets are popped off, gloves are already off. And down to the ice they go. Ben on the face-off against Erickson Eck. And the Stars control it. The half dozen spread out. Colin Miller turns, fires, ricochets, Pavelski hits, he scores! The hat-trick goal, the game-tie goal! Dallas has done it! to Esselindel for his accuracy from the other side of center ice to set up the face-off. It's a block shot that ricochets off. Stars just trying to get possession. They'll win it back towards the wall. That should be enough. Final seconds evaporate. Five minutes of three on three. Hasn't decided it. So a shootout will. A hat trick and four points in the game. In on Flurry, third shooter for Dallas. Backhand, and he got it behind Flurry, but wide of the net. In the last meeting last year, looking for a shootout winner on Wedgwood, who's way out past the crease. A backhand roofed upstairs. Oh my. The Wild go three for three in the shootout overtime, but Minnesota wins it 6 5. Man, what a. What a fake feign and backhand dagger this was. Harley kick, feet moving. Yeah, it, look.